Hi, everyone. I'm pleased to share the latest progress from our research teams as we continue our preclinical work and mark several major accomplishments from last month. First, I'd like to highlight that the results of the RAT trials experiment, led by Dr. Angela Palumbo's team, have been accepted for publication in a peer-reviewed journal. This study validates years of research and supports our path towards clinical application. The article link is on the newsletter post on our website. In our preclinical work, the team has completed the histology and immunochemistry analysis for all 24 skin samples for the decellularization phase. The results are highly encouraging. The analysis confirms our decellularization method was effective and yielded consistent outcomes across all samples. The tissue is confirmed to have no remaining cells, only the foundational collagen fibers. Crucially, the analysis showed that the extracellular matrix or ECM architecture is preserved. This preservation is vital for providing the scaffolding necessary for successful recellularization in future stages. We anticipate having the final results for pyrogens and toxins measurement, DNA content, and scanning electron microscopy or SEM completed this week. These are the final steps required to conclude the safety and structural integrity portion of this preclinical research. Finally, for those who want a closer look at the action, the second episode of our popular 4Gen Inside the Lab YouTube series was recently released. If you haven't seen it yet, be sure to check out the latest look behind the scenes at the incredible work being done every day. Thank you all for being an essential part of 4Gen's journey. We look forward to sharing more updates with you as our project moves forward.